It's always some good time for wrestling and it's time to hit those mats for high school wrestling as the sport continues to grow for the ladies and we were treated to a South Yosemite League duel tonight. Golden Valley and Ridgeview for both the girls and boys. We're going to get it started with those boys. It was heated action in this match and we're going to start this one in the weight class of 220. Ridgeview's Anthony Ramirez against Golden Valley's Damian Avila. Ramirez though, he's going to finish this one out with the pin. Finish out strong to get this match going early for the boys and then we're we're going to take it to the weight class of 120 and in 120 it's Elijah Gutierrez a good move that he's going to pull there ties it up but Jaden Rojos he keeps his lead and he gets the win by decision the Bulldogs they would go on to win this one 51 to 30. Now to those girls the girls wrestling Asada Lewis is going to start things off for Golden Valley in 170. She finishes this off she gets a good takedown here but she's going to finish this off big time with the pin you're going to see it here right now and Golden Valley they were just they they started early and they kept on going. We're going to finish this out here in the weight class of 189. Kevet Osorio, you got to keep an eye on this lady, especially when we get towards state. Big move there. She's going to also finish with the fall. The Bulldogs win this in a route 66 to 18, finishing with three straight pins from their ladies. And Coach Camino has his sights not just set on state, but on a national scale. She right now, currently, as we speak, ranked eighth in the nation, and that's kind of a big deal for us because I mean, you know, that that goes to show that it's we're able to do that. We're capable of getting girls at that level. I feel like I'm setting a good example for the girls that are uh, like uh, underclassmen and that want to someday wrestle. Uh, what captivates me to keep wrestling is just the the passion that I have for it, and it really makes me want to get better in the sport. Fun to watch the Bulldogs and if Osorio makes state championships next month, she'll become the first Bulldog to advance to compete for a state title in all four years.